about the female genital mutilation being an Islamic problem is a perfect example of that. It's not an Islamic problem, it's an African problem. Well, I mean, wait, 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 because he female... says it's a, hold on, hold on a second, because he says it's a, a Muslim country problem. He says that in Somalia... Yeah, but that's... Yeah, and that's actually empirically, factually incorrect. It's a Central African problem. Eritrea has almost 90% female genital mutilation. It's a Christian country. Ethiopia has 75% uh, female genital mutilation. It's a Christian country. Uh, nowhere else in the Muslim, Muslim majority states is female genital mutilation an issue. For the most part, it is not a, a free and open society for women in those states. Well, it's not in Iran, it's not in Saudi Arabia, it certainly is in Indonesia and Malaysia, it certainly is in Bangladesh, it certainly is in Turkey. I mean, again, this is the problem, is that you're talking about a religion of one and a half billion people, and certainly it becomes very easy to just simply paint them all with a single brush by saying, well, in Saudi Arabia they can't drive, and so therefore that's somehow representative of Islam. It's representative of Saudi Arabia. Wait, but Wait we're not talking about women in the Muslim world were using two or three examples to justify a generalization. That's actually the definition of bigotry.